everybody, this is B3Net Games, and today I'm going to show you how to do WASD movement with the Paper 2D side scroller template in C using Unreal Engine 4.10.0. Okay, so first things first, select the character, go to the details window, and we're going to be looking for default movement. Okay, character, movement, general settings. We're going to increase max acceleration to 100. Breaking friction to 500. This will make the movement more steady and linear. Okay, we're going to change the default land movement to flying. After that's finished, we're going to go up to the top to settings click settings, go to project settings, under engine go to input, go to access mappings, change move right to move right or left just to make the C++ code more readable, add an access mapping and change it to move up or down. Now we're going to add W key and we're going to add the S key. Okay, so S is going to be negative 1 because it's going to be going down on the Z axis. After that's finished, X out of the project settings window, click save, and X out of the Unreal Engine. So from here, we're going to build the project from within Visual Studio. In Unreal Engine 4.10.0, they use Microsoft uh, Visual Studio 2015 by default, so make sure you have that installed. Now go to the Source folder, and then go to the My Project folder. Click the little arrows to expand the file directories. Double click on my project character.cpp or whatever you named your um, project as. And go ahead and open the character header file too. Okay. Now we're looking for the input fu functions. Comment out the jump because we don't need that. Change the bind axis to move right or left because bind the axis from within the engine to what we named it. Change this axis to up or down just like we have in the engine. And spelling and capitalization are key for no errors in here. And so are making sure everything matches up. Okay. Now copy copy this function. We're just gonna copy the function and then Add or change the axis that it affects. So this is going to be the function for move up or down. And Unreal Engine um, up and down axis is actually the Z plane because it's a 3D engine. So first one's X, second one is Y, third one's Z. Now they're still red because we need to change prototype functions in the header file. So we gotta change move right to move right or left. Copy this. 
and change this to move up or down because they take in the same values. Keep move right or left, move up or down. And that's why I changed the function to move very left. Okay, so this is. Okay, now we'll start the local Windows debugger. Click on that, and this should build the project without any errors and open up Unreal Engine with the changes we've made. Now, if this is the first time you're building the project, it might take a little bit longer. Okay, so as you can see, Unreal Engine opened again. We push play. We should have WS ASD movement. Making my OBS kind of choppy right now, but you can get that general idea for a top-down game, movement controls. hope this tutorial helped you and anybody else that has watched this video. If you have any questions, feel free to comment, and you all have a good day. Until next time.